2nd April 2021 was Good Friday. It is so called because on that particular day, the greatest good of all times was conferred on mankind, in that God the Almighty Father offered His only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, as sacrifice in atonement for our sins. Therefore, the Universal Church commemorates this day every year in remembrance of the passion and death of our Lord Jesus Christ on the cross of Calvary. If you go through Good Friday, you will celebrate Easter Sunday. This was the headline of the news on Good Friday at the St. George's Catholic Church, Moriton Barracks, Freetown. Our reporter, Brother Lai Nabi, will give us more. The message of Good Friday was delivered by Reverend Father Martin Peter Leobasi. In his sermon, Father Basi lamented on three main characters who were involved in the partial story of our Lord Jesus Christ. The first and major character being Jesus himself. Even though he was forced with so many trials and challenges, yet he did not abandon the mission of salvation. And the second character, Peter, who denied Jesus three times. The third character, Judas, who betrayed his master for 30 pieces of silver coin. Since Good Friday denotes the suffering and death of our Lord Jesus Christ, Easter denotes his victorious resurrection. Father Basti made us to understand that if you go through Good Friday, you will celebrate Easter Sunday. Let us not hear from him. My dear people of God, in our life, whenever we are faced with crises and challenges in life, whenever you experience Good Friday, remember that Easter Sunday is close at hand. God created us not to experience all problems, difficulties, but through those difficulties and problems, we are supposed to see the handing work of God in our lives. As Christians, as Catholics, not every day we are supposed to say that all is well. Those small, small challenges for everyone, as it may be, do come your way for you to reflect. For you to accept God's will and for you to look beyond your lessons so that you will see God and in one. And in all this episode, this drama, the gospel, the three main characters, Jesus, Peter, and Judas. The main one, Jesus Christ was struggling. You see a man struggling to obey his father and trying to let his followers know that his hour has come mm -hmm. and see his followers for it match up so the very drama that was going up and down jesus christ that some of them they were thinking that with all this hosanna hosanna entering into jerusalem will give them a political reward this is the time of the transfiguration when Moses and Elijah when they visited him at that mountain they went through what is going to happen and that's the difference all of us we are going to die in one day a day we do not expect it's better not to expect that you are fully aware that you are going to die and we see Jesus Christ Fully aware that his hour has come, Jesus Christ prayed, Father, take this cup from me, not as I will, but as you will. And that was the torment Jesus Christ went through. Many of us who are like Peter, who see the reality, but we fail to understand. We fail to understand. We have all what it takes to cipher to diagnose the events as we go through our lives. And in most cases, those events are events that are leading us to, to God. But we'll move off, move away. And also, we want and we demand our own what we want that should happen, not what God wants. Judas. Judas sold his master. It's a clear evidence to show that 
in every family, in every community, in every group, there are Judases in there. You might be a Judas, your parish priest will be a Judas. But the question we we'll ask ourselves, do we really need Judases around us? Do we really need them? Do we really need them? Yes. Because when Judas is operate, God's power brings it. was the will of God mm -hmm. that his son has to suffer. And there should be somebody to ignite that suffering. And that person was a very close friend. A very close friend. And in a moment setting, that man is the financial administrator or minister of finance. Because he was handling the money bag. He was handling the money bag. And so in any administration in which we have the finance man, that man is the closest man to the head of state, except for the wives. And so that is the man. And if we want, Jesus said, after dipping the bread into the dish or into the uh, chalice or into the cup, and handing this over to him, Jesus Christ said, Do what you want to do to me. And the fellow disciples thought that Jesus Christ had sent him to go out to buy food or something to give to the poor. And then he went and sold his master 30 pieces of silver. And the sign was just a kiss. And that's why at times when victims have been shared with a kiss, you ask yourself, is it Judas's kiss? That sweet kiss that was given to Jesus by Judas? Is it the end of my own time that this person has given me a sweet kiss? Yeah. And my chief, my dear people of God, Judases are very important. And at times, open our eyes. If you don't have Judases that will break your toe, or will put fire on your hip, you won't realize who you are. In that situation, it's good to have somebody that is a Judas. And that person will help you. To open your eyes and see. And we help you to check and balance your very activity. And even when you have it in the church, in the organization, there are differences there. People that will never appreciate your work. Even when you are trying as the head of an organization, there are people that will pull you down. And I said last week. That is what is seriously disturbing us as a nation. We have so many people who criticize us and very few who are working. And so today, let us thank God that Judas Iscariot decided to do what he had done. Because it was only true that action that we today Come tomorrow and all day, we shall gain our salvation through the death and resurrection of Jesus Christ. And what happened to Judas? He went and killed himself. My dear brothers and sisters, today as we pray for ourselves, let us all pray for all those Judases of ours. That God will transform them so that they will become the light book of humanity, that will become like Jesus Christ, who gave Himself for humanity. And let us pray for all those who are not with us because God has called them for higher service. It's an arrest brother to them, O oh Lord. May the souls and all the souls of the people departed through the mercy of God rest in perfect peace. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit.
Espírito. Sobre